हॅलो एव्हरी वन माय सेल्फ समीक्षा सबाने दि स्टुडंट ऑफ श्री शिवाजी सायन्स कॉलेज अमरावती फ्रॉम बी एस सी थर्ड इयर ग्रुप बायोटेक आय एम डिलिव्हरिंग माय प्रेझेंटेशन ऑन मॉलिक्युलर स्पेक्ट्रोस्कोपी सो लेट स्टार्ट विथ दि मॉलिक्युलर स्पेक्ट्रोस्कोपी हिअर इज दि कंटेंट ऑफ मॉलिक्युलर स्पेक्ट्रोस्कोपी इंट्रोडक्शन इलेक्ट्रोमॅग्नेटिक रेडिएशन पॅरामीटर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रोमॅग्नेटिक रेडिएशन स्पेक्ट्रम ऑफ इलेक्ट्रोमॅग्नेटिक रेडिएशन अँड टाईप ऑफ स्पेक्ट्रा इंट्रोडक्शन स्पेक्ट्रोस्कोपी इज दि ब्रांच ऑफ फिजिकल केमिस्ट्री विच डील विथ स्टडी ऑफ इंटरॅक्शन ऑफ इलेक्ट्रोमॅग्नेटिक रेडिएशन ॲटम अँड मॉलिक्युल स्पेक्ट्रोस्कोपिक टेक्निक आर मोस्ट पॉवरफुल मॉडर्न टूल फॉर द अंडरस्टँडिंग ऑफ द ॲटोमिक स्ट्रक्चर अँड द स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ मॉलिक्युल इलेक्ट्रोमॅग्नेटिक रेडिएशन इलेक्ट्रोमॅग्नेटिक रेडिएशन इज अ फॉर्म ऑफ एनर्जी दॅट इज ट्रान्समिटेड थ्रू स्पेस विथ द वेलॉसिटी ऑफ लाईट वेअर द वेलॉसिटी ऑफ लाईट इज थ्री इंटू टेन रेस टू द पॉवर एट मीटर सेकंड इनवर्स इलेक्ट्रोमॅग्नेटिक रेडिएशन इज द कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ इलेक्ट्रिक अँड मॅग्नेटिक फील्ड विच आर परपेंडिक्युलर टू द डिरेक्शन ऑफ प्रपॅगेशन इलेक्ट्रोमॅग्नेटिक रेडिएशन कॅन बी कन्सिडर्ड ॲज सिम्पल हार्मोनिक वेव ऑफ प्रोपॅगेटेड इन स्पेस or in a straight line visible light ultraviolet light infrared radiation x ray microwave and radio wave are the example of electromagnetic radiation characteristics of electromagnetic radiation all the electromagnetic radiation are associated with the oscillating electrical and magnetic vector at right angle to each other and right angle to the direction of propagation all electromagnetic radiation have same speed in vacuum they travel in vacuum with the speed of light energy can be transmitted to space by electromagnetic radiation different type of electromagnetic radiation differ from one another in their wavelength in this diagram it shown that electromagnetic radiation is the combination of electric and magnetic field which are perpendicular to the each other and also perpendicular to the direction of propagation parameter of electromagnetic radiation wavelength distance between two successive crust which is maxima and trough which is minima is an electromagnetic wave is defined as wavelength it is denoted by lambda different unit like nanometer micrometer millimeter centimeter and meter are used in different electromagnetic radiation spectrum frequency the number of wave passing through a given point in unit time is called frequency of radiation it is denoted by nu and has reciprocal of time nu is equals to c by lambda wave number it is defined as number of wave per unit length velocity the distance traveled by wave in 1 second is called the velocity of wave and is denoted by c unit is centimeter per second or meter per second formula is c is equals to nu by lambda energy the energy is associated with quantum of electromagnetic radiation and is given by e is equals to h nu is equals to s c by lambda where h is planck constant spectrum of electromagnetic radiation the entire range of wavelength over which electromagnetic radiation occur is known as electromagnetic spectrum the first is gamma ray region this region is lying between wavelength 1 picometer to 100 picometer the gamma ray are shorted ray emitted by atomic nuclei x ray region this lie in between 100 picometer to 10 nanometer these x ray are emitted or absorbed by moment of electron close to nuclei of relatively heavy atom involving energy change of the order of 10000 kilo joule per mole ultraviolet region the ultraviolet region the wavelength in this region lie in between 10 nanometer to 400 nanometer electronic transition are induced by ultraviolet radiation the visible region 
The wavelength in this region lie in between about 400 to 800 nanometer. Infrared region. The wavelength in this region lie in between 0 0.8 micrometer to 100 micrometer. Infrared radiation induce vibrational transition in molecule. This region has further divided into following subregion that is near infrared region, mid infrared region and far infrared region. So near infrared region is 0 0.8 to 2.5 micrometer. Mid infrared region is 2.5 to 15 micrometer. Far infrared region 15 to 100 micrometer. Microwave region. The wavelength of this region lie in between 100 micrometer to 1 centimeter. The last one is radio frequency region. The, the wavelength of this region 1 centimeter to 10 meter. Type of spectra. The type of spectra is classified into emission and absorption spectra where emission spectra is further classified into continuous spectra and discontinuous spectra. Discontinuous spectra is further classified into line spectra and band spectra. Absorption spectra is further classified into continuous spectra and discontinuous spectra. Discontinuous spectra is further classified into line spectra and band spectra. Emission spectrum. This type of spectra may be obtained when a light coming after passing through a prism or grafting is examined directly by spectroscope. Continuous spectra. This type of spectrum is obtained whenever matter is in the bulk heated. For example, hot filament, hot iron, hot charcoal that give continuous spectrum. The discontinuous spectrum is further classified into line spectrum and band spectrum. The first is line spectrum. This, this is obtained when line emitting substance is in the atomic state. Band spectrum. This type of spectrum arises when the emitter in the molecule state is excited. Absorption spectrum. When the light from a source emitting a continuous spectrum is first passed through an absorbing substance and then absorbed through spectroscope, it is observed that certain colors are missing which leave dark line or bands at their place. The observed spectrum are called as absorption spectrum. Continuous absorption spectrum. This type of spectrum arises when the absorbing material absorbs a continuous range of wavelength line absorption spectrum in this type sharp dark line will be observed when the absorbing substance is in vapor or gas phase band absorption spectrum with the absorption spectrum is in the form of dark band this is known as band absorption spectrum thank you everyone